experience unlike any other happening right now in Chicago. And here to tell us all about it, the artistic director of Windy City Playhouse and co-creator of the play, Southern Gothic, please welcome Amy Rubenstein. Hi, Amy. Okay. Not interactive, immersive. Explain the difference. Yes, not interactive at all. So literally, when you come to this play, you're invited to be a ghost, an invisible guest at this party. And so actors, characters can't see you at all, but you can get right up and close to all the juiciest bits that are going on. So you get right inside the action, but not a part of it at all. Wow, and it's not a traditional set. This is like a house that you're inside right. watching you this dinner party happen. You built inside the playhouse. Yes. So we took out all the seats from the theater, and then we built this gorgeous house right in the middle of it and there's a there's a back porch with hedges and vines and there's a, a kitchen and a living room and a dining room and a bathroom and all the action takes place in in between all of that now are there certain places where the audience can stand or be or like how do you do you have to work around them so the audience can be anywhere within the house they can move around as the show goes on there are benches there's seating all along the perimeters of the rooms and so people can sit down they can hang out in the back porch, they can walk through the kitchen, whatever they want to do. Right. How, do you, how do you actually get the whole plot? Because you, you don't, because you're in room to room, right? Right. So we've written it in a way so that you get the entire um, arc of the play. You'll understand what it's about, but you might not get all of the subplots. So you have to come back. Wow. Mm. wow. <laughs> how many times do you have to come back before you get the whole thing? You'll get the whole thing. You understand the whole play. You'll never walk away feeling... You know, I didn't. I don't understand that, or I didn't know what yeah, happened. Yeah. It's just you might miss someone making out in the kitchen. You might miss right. someone doing something they shouldn't be doing in the bathroom. Okay, so, got, yeah. it. got it. <laughs> Now I'm, I'm curious what say. they're doing I in the bathroom. Um, so are there different conversations actually happening in different rooms at the same time? How, how yes. is that not distracting at all? You have to just focus in on what the room that you're in. And you'll hear things going on in other rooms. So someone gets in a fight in the other room, you're going to hear it. Well, doesn't everybody want to run over to that room to see happens. what's going on? How many that people can sometimes. fit in there? We only have 28 people a night. That's wow. Nice. And there's eight characters. So you're really, really close. Wow. I mean, yes. how distracted are you? I mean, as an actor, you're trying to stay in character. There's all these people milling about, going <laughs> yeah. from room to room. And it's got to be difficult. They're amazing. This cast is phenomenal. They just don't even see the audience at all. So wow. we're literally you get something. this close to someone. Yeah, and here's the best part, audience, is that the props, the food, the drinks, you can eat and drink, and they're real, right? Yes. <laughs> to the play. Oh, no, no, no. I mean, if it's an open bar, I might be standing by the whole time. So you're invited to the party as a guest, albeit invisible, and so you can eat the snacks that are laid out, and there are different drinks throughout. And it, this takes place in 1961 in the, in the South. It's in Georgia, 1961. So it's really like time traveling back, and then you enter into this house, and then you're given those time period drinks. We didn't even talk about the premise of the show. You just started a little bit. Tell us more. <laughs> okay, so it's four couples that are all best friends and it's one of the girls' birthday parties. It's her 40th birthday party. It's birthday party. Uh, as the night goes on, it starts as this beautiful, fun little party, and as nights go on, people are drinking and drinking more, and secrets start to come out, and it turns Ooh. into a big hurricane of juiciness. Wow, <laughs> that sounds good. It sounds great. We're going to see right. it. Yeah, we're going to go see it. Tickets <laughs> to Southern Gothic at the Windy City Playhouse are currently available through April 22nd, and make sure you check it out. Amy, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you so much for having me. Coming up, what you need to eat to get your body ready for the beat, and then later on, frankly, Hank with illusions. Uh, yeah, illusions. No. Illinoisans. Oh, Illinoisans. Illinois. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Who could be taking home an Oscar? Can't read.